if you're doing a more in-depth Norwegian Fjords cruise, you will get the chance hopefully to visit the village of Honningsvag. It's tucked deep inside the Arctic Circle on a little island called Magora. And it's the most northerly point in Europe. And it's here that the midnight sun shines unceasingly from mid-May through to the end of July. During which time, of course, that the hamlet's numbers swell, and it really is a hamlet, population of 25 and 15 of those are reindeer. And at that time, the Sami people come in with more reindeer herds and they settle on the outskirts of town. And then the sun disappears completely beyond the horizon from the 20th of November and doesn't return again until the 22nd of January. It's a very dark Christmas. Now, Honningsberg, of course, is mainly known as the gateway to the Northern Cape, and this is Norway's most soul-stirring attraction. Standing on these thousand-foot cliffs uh, and then looking out is the best way to witness the, the eerie and mystical and magical midnight sun. It literally appears to, to hang over the Arctic Ocean, and it casts this eerie, ever-present glow. It's a sight you'll simply never forget. Now, another great thing to do here is to climb on board a deep sea raft and uh, to play fisherman for a few hours. King crab, of course, is one of Norway's most famous exports and you can get the chance to head out into the deep blue to help reel in the daily catch. Now, things you can do um, is to obviously taste the delicious crab. The fresh crab is absolutely sensational. You'd also get a chance to see how they catch them in the first place, to see lots of bird life, particularly in the springtime when the birds return. It's amazing. And also one of the local fishermen will no doubt demonstrate uh, the different techniques out on deck of what they do in order to uh, catch the crabs. That's a fascinating tour, but whatever you do, you'll enjoy Honningsvag. It's quite a unique place. And if you get a chance to go there, take lots and lots of pictures.